The view in front of our house is so good. People stop to take a picture of it. <laughs> that is so awesome. All right, here's an update on the back porch rock wall that Ari has been working on. It looks so good. Still not done, we have a little bit more to go, but it's looking really good. We had a $30 gift card to Home Depot from back at Christmas. So we went and got a bunch of perennials. We thought this one was really pretty, but we got one that had not bloomed yet. It's really exciting because these are gonna come back every year. Here's another one we got. We really like this one. This one's flowers are so bright blue, they don't even look real. That's amazing. We really like these, so we got three of them. They do flower, but I really like the way that they look right now. Don't know where we're gonna plant them. What are you putting in there? Forget-me-nots, bluebird. Water your plants. Wet your plants. Wet them. Alright. Oh, so precise. Ah! What? <laughs> so we're gonna go easy because this pot doesn't have any drainage because it's not a good pot. Ah! <laughs> good pot, but not a good one. That's the best pot. It's about to rain, but yes. Yep. <laughs> Who knows? It might not rain. <laughs> Looks like it is. So. All right. All right. Now this is prolonged. Is this where we're planting the isotopas? Isotopas. Oh, isotomas. Isotoma. <laughs> Bug. <laughs> How far away from each other? Um. Space six to twelve inches. Whoa, baby. What? That's a lot. Height three inches. Did you pull it out. Okay, here. We have a knife or something. No, you don't need a knife. Look, watch. Just get in there. Rip it out. Oh, it's so cute. This bird is making the most atrocious noise. Ugh. All right, here is the final placement. So cute, so green, and we're hoping it will just spread all over. All in due time. Investing into the future, hopefully they don't die. It's starting to rain. Is what we've got. So that row is where we planted the zinnias. And they're starting to come up a little bit. All the little zinnia sprouts, so cute.
today is May 9th. It's my 25th birthday. And we bought two wisterias to go on either side of the front of the house. justice flower bloomed slowly but surely the grass is growing we've been watering it every day I was gifted this English ivy for my birthday. It's very gated and it is so beautiful. The grass is growing, hydrangeas bloomed, has a lot of new growth coming in. You can see the forget-me-nots are coming in. This flower bloomed. The wisteria looks like it's about to bloom again. The zinnias are coming in nice. I don't know what this is, but my mom brought it back from her dad's house in Georgia. Half dead, but it has potential. This guy looks like he's gonna live. Our neighbors have horses and they have very generously been bringing us manure. <laughs> so they drop it off here and then we've been spreading it around the yard and it's really helping our grass. So we love that, very thankful for that. It's coming in hot. This ground cover that we planted has flowered and it is so beautiful and it's spreading so nice. 
What are we doing? Making a bouquet. Okay. A bouquet for Father's Day. Nice. All right, every time it storms, this tree creaks and it's hanging where we park our cars. So we've got to cut it down. You can see they're hanging over the driveway. Here we go. Wow, I'm really glad it didn't land on the house. Yeah, that's good. I'm also glad it didn't land on the house. I was a little nervous there for a second. Yeah, How do you were... think it went? Well, with it not landing on the house, it's a win for me. Yeah. Yeah. And look at that. If it would have fallen in a storm, it would have landed directly on both of our vehicles. Exactly where we both park. And now we probably have to get that one too. Yeah, at least just that like one off branch, you see? Yeah, that, that one, that, yeah, right there. Yep. That's not a big deal. No. I'm gonna chop this one up and then we'll work on that one. Wow. Good. Yeah, a lot. Good job. 